It's summertime, which means every Blackstone owner is outside enjoying the sunshine, hosting friends and family, serving up all of their favorite treats off of their Blackstone pizza ovens, air fryers, griddles. In this video, I'm gonna show you three of my favorite treats that I love serving my guests. So join me so that you can make all of this at home on your Blackstone. I love hosting friends and family all year long. The Blackstone has made entertaining and feeding a large crowd so fun and so easy. I'm gonna run down three of my favorite little treats that I love making come summertime. Starting off with griddled popcorn. If you haven't made popcorn yet, it is so simple and also so fun. The kids always love catching those little kernels of popcorn popping up in the air. We start off turning our Blackstone onto high heat. This way we can give it a good cleaning before popping our corn. Now our kernels are gonna need a little bit of oil. I've got a mixture of two different kinds of popcorn here. To that I just add some neutral oil, give it a mix, and then get back over to our griddle. We're gonna wipe this down, scraping off with a little bit of water. Anything that I left behind, I did make chicken wings, my famous little crispy chicken wings last night on here. So we've got to give it a good cleaning. Get it re-oiled with a thin layer of oil. Then down goes a few spoonfuls of our popcorn kernels that we have saturated in some oil. Now, if you need to add more oil to this because you're not hearing it popping, you can always give it a little extra squirt around the kernels. We stick a dome over this, giving it just a shake back and forth, sliding it around the griddle surface, making sure that those kernels have enough oil to begin popping. Popping. You can adjust your heat to medium or medium low once you hear it start popping. This way your popcorn doesn't burn, but you'll just want to keep it moving until you hear those kernels stop popping. And before you know it, you have a ton of popcorn ready to serve up. And one of my favorite things about making popcorn is you can do this in batches and then use any of your favorite Blackstone seasonings. Dust it over the top of this popcorn. Today we're going with the green chili hatch cheddar which is one of my kids favorites on popcorn but literally all of the seasonings really do work well on plain old popcorn if you want to drown it in some butter but griddling popcorn in a small amount of oil is really a healthy option when it comes to popcorn on to another party pleasing little snack this one's a sweet one that my kids absolutely love if you follow me you would have seen my son cameron making this this is one of his specialties that he makes in the blackstone pizza oven for our backyard pool parties and hangouts. This one is so simple and easy. Into a cast iron skillet or pan, anything that will fit into your pizza oven. You can also make this right inside of the air fryer drawers if you want to, we've done it that way also. Load it up with a layer of Hershey's chocolate. Go for dark chocolate if you like it. This is regular Hershey's milk chocolate bars. Top that off with a pile of mini marshmallows. And it's just that simple. It goes into our Blackstone pizza oven so super fast that chocolate melts all at the bottom and our marshmallows get toasty on top. We like extra toasty for that flavor of fire. Then we serve this up family style with cinnamon and sugar graham crackers for dipping and scooping. I promise you this one, your whole family will love if they've got a sweet tooth like mine does. So you might end up wanting to make a few batches of this. Now on to our last one is one of the first things I made on the Blackstone years ago because my kids love funnel cakes, griddled funnel cakes. They taste amazing. They come out a little bit flatter than your traditional state fair funnel cake that's been deep fried, which you can do right on your Blackstone. Just use a sturdy pan if you are going to be deep frying, but shallow frying a funnel cake right on the Blackstone griddle surface gives you the mixture of a funnel cake and a griddle cake or a pancake, but the flavor is spot on. So I know you guys will love this one. And I've seen a lot of people recreate this recipe of mine over the years and they have all loved them just as much. So let me show you. Into a bowl, we mix two cups all-purpose flour with one fourth cup sugar, half a teaspoon of salt, 
one tablespoon of baking powder. And for our wet ingredients, we are adding one cup whole milk, two large eggs, and you'll wanna do one teaspoon or a nice hefty splash of pure vanilla extract, which I ran out of and don't have on hand, so we're going without it. Our griddle surface is on medium heat. You can do this straight on the Blackstone by just adding some oil, just as you do my chicken cutlets, your shallow frying in just a small area of oil, or you could use any kind of egg ring that you have. Then into a funnel, we put our batter, drizzle this into the hot oil, making whatever kind of design you want to. Let it fry on one side for about two minutes until golden brown. Those edges get nice and crispy. The inside of this stays nice and fluffy and soft. We'll give it a flip, giving it a drizzle of oil. If you need a little extra, it'll slide right under that funnel cake and fry the opposite side as well. Once these are done, we plate them up on a little bit of parchment paper or paper towels to sop up some of that oil, then load it up with powdered sugar, just like any good funnel cake. These are dangerous for me because I can't stop eating these once I start. I love them so much. And I know you guys are gonna love these and the popcorn. And what else did we make? Oh, and the s'mores dip. All of these are great little treats to entertain your next backyard, Blackstone, hangout, bash, whatever you wanna call it. I cannot wait to see. I hope you guys post these if you do make them and tag Blackstone products, tag Blackstone Betty. Shop Griddle Nation and BlackstoneProducts.com for all of your summer t-shirts and tank tops. Until next time, I'm Blackstone Betty. I cannot wait to see you for more family style favorites in my next video.